Hello, hello, good evening. Hello. Good evening, Hi. teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Hi, guys. Hi, good evening. Uh, good evening, Josue. Okay, good evening, guys. Um, today we are going to have the next class. That is uh, class number number seven. Uh, I do apologize uh, one more time because I continue sick as you listen to me. I continue sick, so I'm not gonna be using the camera. And uh, but we are gonna have the class, all right. And I will be unmuting the microphone if I need, but there is no problem with that. I hope yes. that you can uh, listen to me uh, good. All right. Teacher. Yes, all three. Yes, yes, of course. Yes. Okay, okay, that's cool. Yeah, someone said, teacher, if you want to make a question, you can do so. Okay, no questions? No. No, no I didn't. O okay, no problem then. Okay. Okay, let me share the the screen with you in this moment so you can see what we got for today as a new topic. So, okay, how are you doing with the platform, with the assignments? Uh, did you finish the unit one and two already? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I did. Yes, 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 I did. Okay, yes, I did. Correct, yes, I did. The question was in the simple past. Okay, cool. Remember, it's important that you continue advancing with the, <clears throat> with the assignment so you don't have to do all assignments at once. It's important that you advance. All right, I'm gonna present my screen. Just a moment. All right. Please uh, confirm that you have the view of my monitor. Okay, can you confirm that you see my, my monitor, guys? Yes. 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 Okay. What do you see? Tell me, what do you see? A sunflower. Yeah, sunflower. That's a sunflower. And it has a zoom. It's pretty cool, the, the picture. Okay, uh, let's open the presentation that we got today. Let me make it bigger. Okay, hi everyone. Today we are going to cover class number seven. 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 seven, yes. Okay. Uh, let's see. Okay, a volunteer. A I never did about success. I work it for it. Work, work it for it. I never did about success. I work for it. Okay, it says, I never dreamed about success. Nunca soñé con el éxito. I worked for it. Trabajé por él. Yes. Okay, that is what we need to do in life, in everything. It's okay when you dream, but remember, we need to take action on things so we can get success. All right, and this is... A phrase of a still louder that I guess is a writer. All right. Good. Um, general indications. You know them. Okay. We are not going to mention them in, in this moment. All right. We are going to advance on the next slide. And remember, if you have doubt questions, you can ask me at any time during the class. All right, let's see. That's not important at this moment. Okay, and as always, uh, we practice day. 
Speaking. Speaking. Good, good. Do you think that you are learning about these or four things during these classes? Yes, of course. Yes, of course. I hope so, because that's going to be uh, very helpful for you, for your learning and growing. All right. Let's see. And the tools. Did you have you explored? Have you explored the tools? Any of those ones? Yes. Yes. Okay. What do you think about the tools that we use in classes? Are they great? Are great. Great. Uh, yes. Yeah, they are very interesting to use. So you can learn many things with those tools. Okay. Uh, let's see. One on one. Today we are gonna practice this. Expressing wishes. Okay. Uh, I'm going to ask for your participation during the whole class so you can help me about uh, the reading in the slides. Okay. Expressing wishes. Uh, the next line says. What's the definition what's of the verb wish? The definition of the verb wish. Okay, uh, what's the definition of the verb wish? And the definition is in the Macmillan Dictionary. And it says... To want something to happen for them. To want something to happen any, any though. Also is... Okay. Unlike, unlike. Okay, the definition says... To want something to happen, although, repeat, although. 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 It is. Although. It is. is unlikely. 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 Okay. Mm -hmm. What is although? Do you know the meaning of um, although? Okay. Ah, okay. It is. And unlikely. Okay. No. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay, when when you don't have or when you have a few probabilities about uh, something happens. Okay, no probabilities or a few or very few probabilities. In other words, is, uh -huh, can you guess it? In other words, a few probabilities. Most probably. Uh, unlikely, okay, that something may not happen, correct. Okay, good. After that definition, uh, we are going to continue with the next one. Okay, just uh, one moment. Okay. Expressing wishes. The phrase, please, can you read it? Use use class, 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 what do what do you wish in life? Speak English as a native job. Oh, English. <laughs> okay, I wish, I wish to I learn wish. English. Uh -huh. Oh, English, hundred percent. Yeah, hundred percent. Ah, oh, but be, if you want to get that, you need to practice a lot, a lot, a lot. Practice, practice, and study and review. Okay, all right. Uh, use wish plus past. Tenses. We are gonna mention this in the plural because we use past tenses with wish. To refer, request and wishes. Okay. To re refer. Can you pronounce it? Refer. 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 To refer. present. To present wishes. Okay. Wish. Oh, uh, okay. All right. To refer to present wishes. Hey, teacher, but you say that we are going to use this expression to refer to present wishes. And this part is 
uh, in simple past. Yes, that is the, the structure that we are going to study. Okay, in the picture, what is that? A house. A house in... Um, very okay. small house. Ah, okay, I wanted to get into that, correct. It is a small house, not a big house, of course. Okay, let's see the sentence. And with this, okay, can you read the sentence, please? I live in a small house. Okay, when you say this, you mean is it the present? The present. The present. The present. Okay, and what is what is a fact? What is a fact for you? Okay, a fact is something that is true. Okay, that you live in a small house. Okay. And after this, now, now, how do I say? How do I say? I wish lived in a big, a bigger house. Okay, okay, good. This is in Spanish, but we need to convert it into the English. Okay, and wish, yes, I wish because we need to use wish. Remember, I wish life. Live, yeah, uh, uh, but live, live is for TV. Live, live. No, live is, live, live is when you live in a house or in an apartment, you live in San Salvador. But if you say live, that means that you are on TV. And we are not talking about channels or TV programs. The verb is live. Okay. What is it? What is the tense? of the sentence present the simple present correct and what is the past tense of the verb live live correct 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 live with t live so the sentence I is wish, i wish lived in a big house okay let's see i wish i live i live in a big in a big Big house. Okay. And mm -hmm. when you are expressing wishes, that means that you are talking about hypothetical situation. Okay. A situation that is not true. A situation that can or might happen in a future. But the situation is not clear, is uncertain, you are not sure that is going to happen. All right, and if you check the sentence, is in affirmative. In the affirmative. affirmative. Correct, in the affirmative. Okay, let's continue just a moment. All right, uh, we are going to continue with the next slide. Okay, what's uh, going on in, in that picture? <laughs> Uh -huh. uh, a boy or a guy to live with her parents, her, his parents. Ah, correct. There is a teacher in the picture, and there is a guy who lives with his parents. Yes, his he's, parents. he's correct. His. Ah, okay, you got it. Okay, perfect. Okay. Now, the boy says, or the guy says, I live with my parents. I live with my parents. Okay, when he says that, that means that that is the present fact that he says. Okay, and now how do I say? I wish, I wish, uh, I wish could live with my parents. Doesn't live, live it with my parents. I don't wish. Okay. Don't. Mm, don't. Okay. Guys, a check. The rule says use wish plus the past tense. When you say don't, that isn't. I, 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 I wish. I wish don't. I didn't wish. I didn't wish. I wish I didn't live. I didn't wish to live my, with my parents. 
Okay, good, good. I okay. Wish Some I of didn't you live live, no, live with my parents. He's not live, he's live. 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 Yes. Live. We are talking live. about the verb live. Never live. live. Okay, good. Some of you said don't and uh, and others of you said didn't. What is the correct the correct didn't. phrase is correct? Didn't. 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 I wish. Ah, yeah. Uh -huh. I wish I didn't. I wish I didn't. I wish I didn't. Okay. I wish I didn't. The best teacher. Uh. I I. I wish yes. I didn't. Yeah, because you are expressing a, a wish, and the okay. subject is is I correct. I mm -hmm. wish I didn't leave, it. but this is the hypothetical situation. Okay. This idea. Okay, because the situation is not this fact. Okay, yes? Okay. Good. All right. Can you read this? The place the bird live in past is normal live like. Uh, remember, in in the same way, when you say I live with my parents, and that is affirmative, yes. And the negative, the negative part of this sentence in the normal, normal negative. I don't live with my parents. Yes, I don't live. You don't, you don't need to place lived in the simple past because didn't is already in the simple past okay did you or do you get that yes, yes? okay see the verb needs to be in the normal form no ed no ed good uh, questions uh, at the moment no please okay not yet. okay not yet okay perfect let's continue then to the next part Expressing wishes now. Now let's now convert, let's the, text convert the next sentence into wishes. Into wishes, into wishes I into wish I have. I wish I have a simple past. Past. Million 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 According with with the with tense, the tense, with the tense of, the of the sentence. Okay. Uh, Not in all times we are going to have uh, the simple past. Okay, we are not all, not all times. That depends on the tense. But remember, you are gonna <laughs> use always the simple past of that tense. Okay, let's try it. How is the sentence in English? I wish I, I wish I had a million dollars. Oh, that sounds pretty good. What would you do with a million dollars? What would you do if you had? Travel, maybe. I would. Repeat, I, I would travel. I would like to travel. I would like to oh, buy a lot of things. Okay, I would do. What is investing? A lot of, excuse me? Eh, lo invertiera. Invest, como, como ah, se dice? okay. Yes. Okay, I would invest. 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 Okay, the verb is I-N. Invest. V-E-S-T. Invest. Okay, that yes. sounds cool. Okay, good. The sentence is, what is the hypothetical fact? This is the, the hypothetical fact. The hypothetical, you have many uh, million dollars. Okay, can you repeat it? Uh -huh. To have million dollars. Yeah, but complete, complete. I, 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 wish, I, I, I wish I had one million, million dollars. Okay, we are going to write it. Okay, we are going to write it. That's why this this space is there. I, what is the verb that I use? Wish. I wish. I wish I had. I have. 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 Have.
has porque tiempo pasado. Ah. Yeah, because it remember. It says one million remember million. to use the simple past accord. Okay, one million dollars. Okay, correct. And that is the hypothetical situation. Situation. It was wrong. Good. And if you check the sentence now, it's correct. You are using wish plus the simple past in the next verb. And now it's correct. Good, good. All right. Let's see. Let's continue with the next one. Mm -hmm. Look at the picture. Focus on the picture first, and then you can read the sentence. I wish I wish I, I didn't have have dollars in the bank. Dollar in the bank. Twenty. I didn't. Fifty. I didn't, I didn't have, have, have $50 in the bank. In the bank. <laughs> All right, good. Uh -huh, okay. $50 in the bank. Uh, 50, no 20. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is a... Uh, this is the hypothetical situation, but in the Spanish. But in English is? I didn't I have. I didn't have. Yes. Didn't because have. It, when you see no, that means that is the sentence is <laughs> negative. Yes, yes it's negative. Yeah. But negative. we need to use, uh -huh, it's negative, but we need to use the simple past according with the tense of the sentence. Uh -huh. What you need to check carefully is the tense of the sentence. The tense. And the verb, of course. And the verb. And now it's correct. <laughs> good. Good, good. <clears throat> Questions? Mm, for the moment. Not for the moment. No. Okay. No. Good, good. Yes, yes I are... have a question, sir. Uh -huh. Go ahead. Yeah, I have a question. Yes. Uh, I'm sorry because I, right now, I am connect a little bit late yes uh, when you use wish you have to use uh, the past the simple past yeah correct uh, we need to use because we are expressing wishes yeah although the structure is referring to in the simple past but those are wishes in the present it's a little bit confusing at the beginning, <clears throat> but remember, we can express wishes in the present, but the wishes, uh, they referred in the simple past. Why in the simple past? Because they are not true in this moment. They are not true. Okay. They are imaginary situations that you wish to have in the reality. All right? Okay. Good? Okay. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Let's see. Uh, we we have this uh, in this part. What is the tense? Yes. The tense. What is the tense um, of the sentence? I live in a small house. Okay. But what is the tense? When I ask Pres the tense, uh -huh. simple present. Okay. Is it in affirmative? It's in negative? Or is it a question? Is in a affirmative. Yeah, because the sentence doesn't say, I don't live in a small house. It's affirmative. Yeah. So, it, the wish that you want to express because you live in a small house, that is the present fact, el hecho del presente, that you live in a small house. But you wish to change this into, into this. And it would be, is that it? I wish. I wish I lived in, 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 in a bigger house. Okay. How does how does sound into the Spanish? How does sound? Huh? Is this? Desearía no vivir. vivir en una casa yeah. grande. Afirmative, afirmative. Check. Correct. Uh, is this, is this a wish that you have? Yes. 
It is a wish that you want, correct, in the present. Although, aunque, although the structure that we use for expressing wishes is in the past tense, because that is the, the rule. And that's it. That's it. Yes. Okay. In this one, see, the, the same one, right? Simple present. Uh -huh. Is it in the in the negative? No, no, no. it's in the affirmative. But this one, this one is in the negative, yes. and you yes, and it's a wish. Uh -huh. And you need to, sorry, and you need to say this into English. And how would you say it? Como lo diría? How would you say it? I wish I, I wish I didn't live with my parents. Mm -hmm. Correct. See. You are using didn't. Why are you using didn't? Because in this sentence, although it's in the Spanish, it is in negative. No, 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 no. We can place it in, in the negative. I don't live with my parents. It would be the inverse. Sería la inversa, right? I don't live with my parents. Uh -huh. Yeah. In this one, how this would one it be? Is... Yeah, I, I wish, wish live with, I my, parents. Live with my parents. Okay, just imagine that the sentence is in negative. I don't live with my parents. You live alone in the city. Alone in the city. And I how wish, can you express I wish? I wish live. I, I wish live. My live. You need to mention live. I twice. I wish I, I, I live with my parents. Okay. And that would be in Spanish? Yes, it is the inverse. Yeah. All right? Right. Good. Okay. Let's see. Uh, we have already passed this. The same case, but we are not using uh, the verb, <clears throat> any other verb. We are using to have. Okay. And this is the equivalent uh, the hypothetical situation of this. All right. Good. Yes. Good. We're yes. gonna we're gonna do some practice. Don't worry. But you are again in it. Great. Okay. Ah, you said this one already. See? What is the tense? It is not in English, but you know the tense. Yes. I sent. I wish. Okay, okay. You you wish. Okay, you wish to have another situation more than this one. Okay, the wish is in the present, but the structure is in the simple past tense. Do you get that? Yes. Yes, yes. guys, and and the rest. I only listen two or three people. Uh, responding or practicing or or saying and what about the rest it's important that everyone can get these uh, this structure oh this there is some interference okay let's continue we can do more exercises mm -hmm. ah that is me <laughs> that is me but I am not like this. I'm not covered with a sheet. Uh -huh. What is? I wish. 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 I didn't feel or I am not. I didn't. I wish I didn't be sick. Even sick today. I didn't be sick. Be sick today. I didn't. Well, I wish. I, I, wish I wasn't. I wasn't today. sick today. No. Okay, good. It cannot be didn't. Why? Wasn't. It, yeah. Okay. This is the first clue. Mm -hmm. Wasn't uh -huh. or weren't. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I wish I wasn't. I wasn't. I wish I wasn't. Okay. 
Let me tell you that if you say, okay, by by logic, por lógica, by logic, you say well, well, to be. that is wasn't. Because if you remember the verb to be in the simple past, it goes like this uh, in the affirmative. Okay. Uh -huh. Tell me in the affirmative verb to be in simple past, affirmative. Was. I. I. Um, I, I, am, I, am, I am. I am six. No, no I am simple, six. in the simple past, not in the simple present. I was. 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 Uh -huh. You? I was six. You six were six. six. You were. She was. Six. You were. She, she, was. she were. No. She was. 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 It was. They were. They were. We were. We were. We were. We were. We were. You, were. were. you were. Yeah, correct. Okay. That is in the affirmative. In the negative. <laughs> Uh -huh, I, gotcha. wasn't, I wasn't. I wasn't. I wasn't. You weren't. You weren't. She wasn't. She wasn't. She wasn't. She wasn't. 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 She okay. wasn't. We weren't. They weren't. They weren't. We weren't. We weren't. They weren't. You weren't. You weren't. Yes, yeah, correct. Correct. That is the the form, but <laughs> because it is the verb to be that is here is here it couldn't be no podía it couldn't be didn't no it would be incorrect it is. yes correct but let's read a little bit to understand about wasn't or wearing uh, okay i need a volunteer for the next slide maybe oscar can you help me with the reading oscar yes okay Expressing wishes in the case of the verb to be. What is the difference between were and was? Between, between. Between, between. What is the difference between were and was? Were and was are both past, past tense version of the verb to be, but what is usually used in relation to second person singular and plural pronouns such as you, your, yours. It is also, also, it also used with select first and third person plural pronouns such as with they. Okay, stop for a moment. Okay, this is what you just uh, had, what you just uh, mentioned. Eso es lo que acaba de mencionar. I was you were, he was, and in the negative too. It is the same. I wasn't, you weren't. It is the same, but this is in a paragraph. Okay, but it is the same. Okay, let's see, continue, please. Uh, Arnulfo. Continue, Arnulfo, with, with this part. Can you hear me? Yes, yes, we do. Yes. Okay. We use was on the other hand when we're using the first person singular pronoun or using the third person singular. I. This is I, this the subject, I. I, ah, sorry. From I or using the third person singular such as he or she. Or she. Okay, let's pronounce. Uh, what is the pronunciation of the uh, contraction? Where? 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 It's not where. Where. Uh, where. 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 Okay, where. 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 Okay, it says we use was. Where. On the other hand, when we are using the first person, first person. singular pronoun, I was, correct? In the affirmative, I was. Okay. Or using the third person singular, such as he. Or she, he was, she was, etc. Continue. Uh, another volunteer for this part. Uh, me. For example. Okay. For example. For you. example. Okay. Only you one. Will. Only one. <laughs> okay. Okay. The first one that spoke. El primero okay. que habló. The first me. one that spoke. Okay. okay. For example, you will. You wouldn't say you was going to the store. Uh, you, you wouldn't say that, right? Is that correct? Yeah. No. Was no, big mistake. 
You should be aware, correct? You store. were going, iba para la? We're going to the store. The store, okay. The store, you would say you were going to the store. Okay. Incorrect. And this one is the correct right. with the verb okay. to be correct in the simple, simple past. Yes. yes, because you were, right? You was never, never. Okay. okay. Uh, next volunteer is going to be uh, Elizabeth Mejia. Okay. Uh, in the case of the verb to be, why, why is I wish I were correct? So, ah, okay, okay, just a moment. It's telling you the correct form, see? Why is I wish I were correct? It's telling you that this is the correct form. Continue, please. So, what happens when you're, you're talking about I wish I were? I, no. Okay, is, as first... Uh, I see. Okay. Let me. Mm -hmm. Is a first person singular pronoun, which is. Which is one makes. Which is one makes using word sing confusion. Shouldn't we always use was after I? No, peor. No. No, it's, it's no. Okay, nope is informal nope. English. Nope. Okay. So, what happens when you're talking about I wish I were? Is a first person singular. Remember, first person singular, which is what makes using words seem confusing. Shouldn't we always use was after I? No. Okay, never. In, because we are talking about expressing wishes, never is going to be, I wish I was. Never. And the explanation is here. Uh, can you help me? Jancy mm -mm. Sarai Sanchez, please. I wish I were is actually the preference of grammar experts because you're talking about something that uh, hasn't actually occurred, which is used for imaginary or hypothetical mm -hmm. statements or questions, mm -hmm. where it's always correct in the past subjunctive. Okay, this word is talking about a tense. But you uh, you need to pay attention to this. I wish I were is actually the preference of grammar experts because you're talking about something something that, something that has actually, actually, actually occurred. In other words, is hypothetical. Hypothetical, or if you want it in simple words. Not true on real things or on real situations, imaginary situations, etc. And that is what it means hypothetical it's statements or questions. Where only is in that case, I'm sorry, only in that case, we use I wish I were. Yeah, correct. Correct. That is what he's telling. Is yeah, correct. Because it's actually the preference grammar of experts. When you say preference grammar, it means that it, that is the correct form. Because you are talking about something that hasn't actually occurred. Okay, for which is used uh, for imaginary or hypothetical statements or questions. Where is always correct okay, in the past right. Okay, in other words. In other words, you use I wish I were. Okay. Uh, in a simple way, when uh, when you want to express a wish where the verb to be is used, you are always going to use I wish I were. I wish I were. But for? 
wishes. expressing wishes. For expressing wishes. Okay. Expressing in, wishes. In the present. Yes. For mm -hmm. expressing wishes in the present. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I know that this might be confusing a little bit at the beginning, but with exercises, we can understand more. Let's continue. Okay, teacher. Uh -huh. It's only occur with the pronouns I. Uh, <clears throat> can you repeat it, please? <laughs> uh, we use where only for oh, that. The modification is only for I, the pronoun I. Yeah. The other pronouns, mm -hmm. do you use the normal way? Yeah, because imagine you are expressing a wish that you have, not that another another person has. Is your wish correct? Is something that you you wish? Mm -hmm. Something that you wish. Uh, how do I say her? Uh, or can you give me a one sentence with the verb to be? With I wish I wear. In Spanish? Uh, in Spanish first. Then okay. we can desearía estar en la playa, for example. I, uh -huh. I desearía wish, estar. I wish to wear. I wish I, I wear wish in the beach. I wear on at, the beach. At, ah, at the beach. At the beach. The beach. Okay. I wish I were at the beach. Okay. Is this sentence uh, your wish? The wish that you want to have? Is your wish? Yes. 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 Okay. Yes. It's something that you want, yes. but you don't have in this moment. So it is imaginary. Imagine you are at work. You are working in your office and you suddenly say, I wish I were at the beach and drinking a coconut, swimming, etc. Okay, because this is your wish. You are thinking in this imaginary situation. And where are you at? Where are you at? What is there? Beach. Uh, no, this is the the imaginary situation. Uh, in my house. Imaginary. No. Okay, this, this is the imaginary sentence. And what is the fact? What is the fact sentence? That I'm in my house. I'm at my house. working, right? I'm at... I'm at work. work. Oh, so boring. I'm at work. Okay. And the sentence, this is the... Fact. The fact situation. Okay, do you get the difference between the two sentences? Yes. Yes? Okay, when you say I, I am at work, that is a fact because that is the place where you are at, el lugar donde está. But you wish to be in a different, in a different place. So, you can say... I wish I were. I wish I were at the beach. And that is the imaginary situation. Okay. Is that clear? Yeah. Yes, but maybe my question is... What, <laughs> no what you with... Okay, ask ask again, please. Ask okay. again. Es que yo me pregunto que si solo esto pasa con el verbo, con el pronombre I. I. Uh, Los demás no, first person. son iguales como... Se mantiene, digamos, la tercera persona was y la otra was. O okay. cambia también. Uh, that depends on the sentence and on the subject. The subject is? I. Is I. I. But you can, have, you can have another subject that is not I. In that case, it could be was. But we are going to do exercises to understand that. But at first, the first subject, when you have I, is this structure. I wish I were when the subject is I because it is a wish of yours. Correct? We can... mm -hmm. What do I have, what do I have with other subjects? For example, you. We are going into that in a moment. We have exercises, but we need to advance with this. Okay, let's see. Uh, in this part, 
What is the fact situation? I'm not patient. I'm not patient. Uh, I'm not patient with kids. Sure. I'm not patient. And we have the example in Spanish. Uh -huh. How do I say that in English? I wish I were wish. as patient as my mom. As patient like my mom. Uh, question as my mom. Question <clears throat> as my mom. Share your microphone. Oh, sorry, I was speaking and the microphone was the activator. Sorry, guys. Okay, who is the person that is saying this? Who is the person? Yeah. First person. Paciente. Mm, but it says. Yeah, first person. Yeah, first person. What is, what is the subject in this? I, I, correct, I, I, correct. You I, are saying it. You are saying it. And what is the subject for para mi, para yo? I, 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 I correct. I, I, correct. Because the subject is I. I wish I were as patient as my mother. Correct. That's it. Okay, let's do exercises. Ah, okay, but we have another one. Let's see. Uh huh. I can't help. I can help. I can help you with loan. With a loan. What is a loan? Prestam. Yes. Okay. Don't Where? ask for loans. Don't ask for them. Okay. Uh -huh. And we have the sentence in the Spanish. We need to convert it into English according with the tense. Okay. Uh -huh. I wish I were. I wish I wish is correct. I wish I wish I will help you with a loan. With a loan. Okay, can you repeat it one more time? I wish I will help you with a loan. Okay. Uh, Where or check, did check something? Okay. Why did you say where? And the question will be, do you see the word to be in this no. sentence? No. I wish I can help you. I can help you. Okay, but remember, okay, let's go back to the first slide. Okay, remember, I, use wish plus the past tense. And what is what is the verb that we have in that in that cool. sentence? Ah, okay. The moral verb is. The moral verb is. Cool. Cool. This one. This one. Can. 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 Is it Can. in affirmative or negative? Negative. Negative. Ah, okay, yeah. negative. So I don't need to use the verb to be because ah. no verb to be in the sentence. Uh -huh. So is I wish. I wish I can help you with what is the, sim the simple past of can? Yeah. Cold. 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 I wish I could, I wish I could help, help you, you, help you with alone. With, with alone. alone. But I can't. No. I have no money. I can't. See? Depending on the sentence, depending on the on the on the tense and the verb. It doesn't matter if you if you have the verb to be, the verb have, or if the sentence is in negative, you need to use the simple past. See, simple past of can? Could. Could. Okay. 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 But here is in negative. I and couldn't. why he I couldn't, I no. wish I couldn't help you in the Spanish. How would it be? ¿Cómo sería eso en español? Si fuera sería, no podría ayudar. 
Ah, oh, it would be weird. Sería raro que uno dijera eso. De sería no poder ayudar. O sea que, lo voy a decir en español, no tiene la disposición de ayudar. So bad. So bad. Ajá, aquí sí la Le tiene. Debería poder ayudarte. Ah, correct. Yes. Por eso acá está en, en the normal, pero en el simple past. Porque no puede ir en, en the negative, porque si no estuviera diciendo en español. Desearía no poder ayudarte. Y, no, right? Ah, correct. That is what you need to pay attention to. Eh, eso es lo que se necesita poner atención, ¿verdad? Depende de lo que queramos decir. Pero aquí, do you have any disposition to help with the sentence? Yes. Do you have disposition yes. to help? Yes. yes, you have it. Yes. Okay. Do you have the same disposition into the English sentence? Yes. Yes, correct. Yes. yes That's I why have. it couldn't be current. Por eso no podría ser current. Got it? Got it? Got it? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. Okay. Good. Just, just a moment, guys. All right. Let's see. Good. Good. Uh -huh. Let's practice about how to express wishes. Okay. Let's open some links and let's practice with this. Okay. Let's see. I'm gonna hit stop. Okay, what is the sentence? I wish I had the party. I wish I had at the party. What is the correct the correct verb? According stay. To stay. Stay. stay in the present. Stay. 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 Mm. stay or is staying? Stay. 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 The third one. Stay. Okay, let's see. So meet. I, I, I have it. No. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's I try wish with the next one. I, I wish, wish I had. I have. I have. Okay. Your okay. Okay. Look. Okay. Take it. 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 Taken. Porque yeah, está en, yeah. en un tense que desearía no haber tomado. Right? Wish, It's a different tense. I, uh, I wish I were. 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 Ok. Let's, let's see something. Okay. You see the sentence. You see the sentence. What is the fact situation? In I this will, sentence, I'm sure. I could tell her. Ah, okay, yeah. correct. I am sure that is the, the fact her. sentence. That is the fact sentence. I am sure. I don't want to be sure. I want to be taller. Uh -huh. yes. But remember that you are expressing a wish I about wish. this. Uh -huh. I wish I were. Okay, correct. Let's go I'm back sure. to the to the sentence. Okay, so I wish I wish, 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 wish I were. Where? I wish I could. I wish I was. Oh, no, I, I wish I was. I, I wish I was. Oh, okay. Remember, remember, remember something, was. guys. Remember Tengo something. Uh, remember I something. We are I gonna could. we are gonna come back to this part. Okay. Where I was, blah blah blah. Uh -huh. Okay. But where it says <clears throat> I know it's the next one, right? And for <laughs> happens when you're talking about I wish I were, the preference, okay, it's I wish I were is actually the preference of grammar experts. That okay, means that in grammar is the correct, uh, the correct, the correct way. But remember that we have in English, informal English, that maybe sometimes we have things that we say that are not correct. Right, but even though we use them, aún así las usamos. See, for example, in songs, 
in songs you can see many expressions that are incorrect but people use it people always use it but that depends or if it's in formal english or if it's formal english that's why in the sentence the exercise it was was, was okay but yeah, in, the, was. in the correct grammar in the correct grammar is where was. Okay. where I wish. I wish. Uh -huh. I were. I wish. I were. No, I wish I was. I wish I was. Okay, that is what I'm telling you. Por eso es lo que, lo que les digo. Ajá, la sí. gente a veces siempre usa una informe incorrecta, pero en grammar eh, sería where. Okay, and that is the difference. Esa es la diferencia. Wishes. Okay. Sí. He, which is he was going there. He wishes he was Ooh. going. He wishes he, he no wishes he, he was he could going to Paris. Could. Okay. Uh -huh. Good. What's the next one? The next could. answer. Could. Was. I think I was. Okay, I was. Think, uh, was? Yes. No. No. What? Could. Could. I say no. could. Good. Why good? good? I wish. So, no, this is other. I wish it had. Uh, okay. Passing. Let's Passing. try with this one. Passing. Pass. I wish he had. Pass. 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 Head right test. Ah. Okay. No, la, la tercera, el morado. Pass. Pass. The fourth. Passing. Okay, let's see. The first. No. The first one? The first, the first. No. 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 Pass, pass, pass. Yeah. 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 It's in pass, simple pass, <laughs> correct. Yes. I wish you had pass. I wish you had been. Been, 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 been. Been, 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 been. Been, 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 been. Been, 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 been. Been, 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 Into the Spanish, what is the meaning of this into the Spanish? Sería no haber estado perdón, enojado conmigo. Contigo, okay, good. Bien, because bien is the participle. Uh -huh. And this means a tense that is past participle. Let's see, so bien. Correct. Yes. Bien. Okay, guys, the only way to understand this topic It is doing many exercises. Okay. Next. I wish Marcus had get get up early. Had get get up not early. Get up. Get up. Get up early. Get up. Get get no. No. Get okay. But it wasn't. I wish. I wish. I wish. I wear. On the page. Okay, remember. No, in, no. in grammar, no, in, para plural. guys, guys, in formal grammar, as we read, como leemos, in formal grammar, it's a where, but, but, okay, okay. but this one is, uh -huh. yes. this one is the form that people use. Esta es la forma que la gente usa, but in grammar, is where. Okay. He wishes he, he wishes he had 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 no bad. No bad. Okay. Can, you <laughs> can continue practicing. Two minutes. <laughs> okay. Two minutes. <laughs> let's had 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 This is about ordering the the words. Okay. They wish. Uh, they wish. It wish. They wish. It, they wish. They wish. Was it, it was, was June? June. It was June. June. Correct. Ellos desean que fuera junio, yes. but we are in November. <laughs> Correct. Yes. He 
English fluent. English All right. Very good. Next. You you wish, wish you wish you wish you had studied more for the test. You had you had you had you had you had study you had study more more for the test, the test. more for the test more for correct the test. For the test. okay in Spanish is. Okay, good. I wish I had more I time. Had more time. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay, that you say that when you are 50, when you are 60 years old, to do more things yeah. that you didn't do in the past. <laughs> I wish I, I, I had more time. time. Have. Okay, correct. Have. More time. More time. Yeah. Okay, mm. the last one because of the time, I guess it's already it's already nine o'clock. She, 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 yeah. she wishes. 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 Home for vacation. All right, very good. Okay, there is a sentence. Okay, guys, in the presentation, you will have uh, the three links. You can continue practicing uh, with them, okay? Or you can find more exercises about this topic in 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 your free time using another website. Okay. Uh, okay. Sure. Uh -huh. If I didn't receive my uh, the link, why not? But I yes. sent the presentation I, like three I, times. I think you don't person. have my number. Ah, uh, no, ya se unió al grupo. No. Guys, you can leave, guys. Uh, only Pedro, if you want to stay, si quiere quedarse. Guys, thank you for hey, joining to the class. Night, Have night. a good night. Uh, thank you very Have much. Thank you. Bye-bye. 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 Okay, uh, Pedro, bye. nos ha venido al link de WhatsApp. See you tomorrow, teacher. Yeah, see you tomorrow. No sé cómo, cómo hacerlo. Ahí. Ah, okay. Bye. Le voy a enviar ahorita el link de WhatsApp para que okay. se una ahorita. Porque si no se une al link de WhatsApp en el grupo, por eso no recibe la presentación. Ah, ok. Porque no está, no ha aceptado, no se ha unido a la invitación. Ah, yo creí que me tenían que, que unir en el ah, grupo. Ah, no, no. Estos links, tanto uh -huh. como el de la plataforma, el de WhatsApp, el de la lista de reproducción de YouTube, todo eso se lo envían al correo. Pero ahorita okay. le envío el de, el de WhatsApp para que se pueda unir. Uh -huh. No hay problema. Uh -huh. Solo lo envía al WhatsApp o, o cómo? No, no. O usted solo le da clic a ese link que le voy a enviar ahorita. Revise el chat de Zoom. Ya. Eh, sí. okay. Yeah. ok. Me dice cuando le dé clic. Corporativo. Crean, dice. Ajá, sí, solo le da, le da clic a, a ese link. Dele ah, clic. Pero, pero, es que no, no, no entiendo cómo. Pero ya tiene el chat. Estoy en el chat. Ajá. En el Me chat de, de Zoom, ¿verdad? En el chat de Zoom. De, de Zoom. De esta reunión. Ajá, de esta reunión. Ahí hay una opción que dice de lemas. Okay, More. Ya, ya le encontré. Y chat. chat was... Del... Ah, okay. Okay. Ya okay. ve el chat, ¿verdad? Ya. Yeah. Ahí dice, tampoco estoy maestro, hay una carita y después... Ah, unirme, el... al, unirme al chat. ¿no? Correcto. Ok, le da clic. Unir, yo en chat, Ajá. unirse al chat. Cuando le dé ahí, me parece le va a que... abrir WhatsApp. Ajá, descargar. O... No, abrir WhatsApp. WhatsApp no está instalado, dice. Ah, vaya. Entonces, en ese caso, <coughs> veamos. Bueno. bueno, déjame usar el WhatsApp web. Ajá, el WhatsApp web, con WhatsApp web lo puedo usar, Ajá. correcto.
Y cuando abra WhatsApp, abrir con WhatsApp web, ahí abre su WhatsApp en el teléfono. Me avisa okay. cuando esté ahí. Ajá, porque estoy en la compu. Pero ya está, el... ya está viendo el código QR. En, en WhatsApp, no, en WhatsApp eh, web. Ya lo, tengo, ya lo tengo abierto. Ah, vaya. Entonces, Ajá. dele, dele este, yo en chat, unirse al chat. En... En, en el WhatsApp. Sí, en el WhatsApp. Pero... O si no, si no ajá, bueno, si no hay problema, deme su número, lo voy a guardar y le mando para que lo haga directamente desde el teléfono sin tener ajá. que hacerlo ahí. Ah, ok. Permítame. Eh, okay. 76. Permítame. 76. Ok. Mm, ok, permítame. Si gusta, envíeme en el, en, el, en el chat el número. No lo menciona aquí en la clase. No hay problema. Ah, ok. Escríbalo ahí. No, por, no le doy terminar la miren porque si no, no va, va a cortar la, la comunicación ahorita. Estoy buscando la miren. No la... El chat, el que tenía Ajá. abierto ahí, envíemelo. Ese ya lo recibió. Se lo metí para solito, pero le da un agua, por agua, por ahí, 